Hi guys, I thought I'd do a monthly favourites for you. I'm sorry it's a tad bit late. I've been a bit busy um, decorating my room and moving things around, so I thought I'd just get into it now. Um, the first favourite I have got is this Spice Buttercream Candle. Um, I bought this about two years ago, and I still have tons left. It smells like obviously like buttercream, and it was on sale. It was. 3.49 at Clinton's so I picked that up because it just smells amazing and it just makes my room smell like spiced buttercream and it does make me hungry so yeah the next favorite I have got is makeup so my first favorite of makeups I've been using is this Maybelline Rocket the vol the rocket volume um, I bought this at Home b and it was about £4 I think, or 2 I can't remember, and obviously it's in black, and it looks like that, like this, this is the brush, brush. Um, I only wear black because um, I feel that it just looks better on me, so I just use black. The next favourite I have been using this month is this Rimmel London Match Perfection in the shade 100 Ivory. Um, I wanted to try the red one but they didn't have it in stock so I went for the blue one. Um, I don't think there's any difference really. Um, sorry I keep looking at the screen, it's just the screen's a lot bigger. I am filming on my iPad at the moment because I can't be bothered to get my tripod out and my camera so just use my iPad. But anyway, I've been using this and I love it because um, I find that some foundations I buy are far too dark for me. Um, but this is the perfect colour for me as I tested it out in the store and it was just perfect. So I tried that and I love it and I will be purchasing it again. Next thing I've been loving is this lash that Lasting Perfection collection by collection. Um, this this prime the primer this concealer is very very popular as one of my favorite youtubers likes this concealer i've been using this for god knows how long before um i even watched Zoella. but uh, i'm in the shade one fair because um i thought pick up a bit lighter one just to make it blend in nicer um i absolutely love this concealer and i will be purchasing it again because it's just such a good what's the word liquid and it hides all your blemishes and your under eyes if you got bags which i probably have uh the next thing i have also been loving is this silky beige stay matte foundation powder i've been using this for god knows how long now and i use it to keep my foundation in place and it does the job um i've got that let much left. I do have another one currently, so I will be using that when all of it is gone. But I absolutely love this um con this concealer, this felt powder, and I will be purchasing it again in the near future. It just covers up like if you see patches, it just covers it all up by using the powder, and that's what I use it for. And it looks like that. And Rimmel London is a good brand. Uh, next thing that I've been loving is this collection highlighting sculpt thing, highlighting sculpt. Um, you don't get a brush with it, but you just get these colours. That one's the highlighter and that one's the sculpt, I think. Contour, sorry. And it's basically a contour kit because I thought, I'm going to try contouring. So I bought this. It was quite cheap, so because the collection is quite cheap. Um, and it tells you on the back how to apply it. So I've been using this. And I really, really like it because you don't really need to go out all expensive for a contour kit. You just buy a cheap one. So that's what I've got. And it looks like that. And I love using it. Next makeup favourite is this Peach Party by Soap and Glory. I've had this quite a while now. Um, I'm not sure if you can get it anymore. It's called Apricot Jam. And I just absolutely love this um, shade of blush. It's just it's a really glistening colour. And it looks like that. And I just absolutely love it. It makes your cheeks all glistening. I've actually got it on today. Don't know if you can see, put it here. You can see the light bouncing off it. Um, and I really, really like it. Um, like I said, it's by Soap and Glory. I think I got it at Boots or Super Drug. I'm not sure if they have this anymore, but you could go check if you want. Um, I'm not sure how much it was because, like I said, I bought it ages ago. And the last makeup favour I have is this Eyes Uncover collection palette. Um, nude bronze palette. Um, I bought this when um, I wanted to get them some money for the bus and I had no change, so I just bought it to get some change. This was about £4. Um, obviously, it's a nude bronzing palette. 
and I love it and it comes with a little um, little brush uh, my favourite is all of them because I, as you can see I use all of them they're all messy so I use all of them and on the back it tells you um, all the colours um, like I said all, my favourite is all of them because they're just such gorgeous colours I love like making like sh shadow um eyes like shadowy and stuff so I, I like to use this quite often but I do use my number seven palettes which are a clone of the um naked palettes obviously I, d I don't want to go expensive on palettes it's just ridiculous uh so the next thing that I've been loving this month is games um I bought these three games about I think it was a couple of weeks ago but I, would, I really wanted to include them so I got Uncharted 1 um uncharted two and uncharted three um i think i got these for like 15 pound um they're really 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 good um i watched pewdiepie play uncharted four um and i really really like the way um it's like the game set out and everything is like adventure and puzzles and i love those kind of games so i picked up all these three um, i'm currently on this one at the moment and i am stuck but um I will pass it. I usually just like give it a few, give it a break for a few weeks, and then I go back to it, and then I figure out how to do it. But it's basically about him. It's like Lara Croft, and he searches for like tombs and treasure and stuff. And I really love it. Um, I haven't played this one or this one yet, but I'm really really excited to play them. And they are Uncharted at bar on PS3, but I'm I'm really glad you can't get Uncharted Four because it's on PS4, and obviously I don't want to spend money on a ps4 just to play one game and um, that's uncharted and i absolutely love it if you guys would like me to do a review on these all these three games or this one at the moment comment down below and i'll do that for you uh the next favorite i have been loving is uh this perfume and it's by britney spears it's called circus um i bought this from bn home bar bnm ages ago it was about um a fiver because obviously it's only the small one and i absolutely love it i love the smell i love the bottle it's just a really cute fragrance to have and makes your room like like really smell really really nice. You just walk in and it hits you. Um, I will be hopefully purchasing it again or I might just get the big bottle but I'll probably get the small bottle because it's cheaper. So that's Britney Spears Circus. Next thing that I've been, next thing is this perfume by Playboy. I bought this from um, Home Bar B&M as well. It was on the like checkout um, check out baskets as you go out um, and I've only used a little bit but I do love the smell um, and I love the little bottle I think it's so cute it's, I love the little bunny ears because um, I love little rabbits so I just thought oh my god it's so cute and the smell is amazing um, sometimes I actually spray it around my room just to give it like a, a nice smell and it's amazing and I think it was about tenor I'm not sure but there's that one I'm not sure what scent it is it doesn't say at the bottom but it was so pretty and it smells amazing. Next thing is this just pink body mist by Next. It was six pound and I picked it up ages ago. I just used this on me and I spray it around the room because um, I absolutely love this smell. Um, the perfume my mum's got and I got the mist because I just love it. Um, like I said, I spray it around my room just to make the room smell a bit nicer because sometimes for breeze it doesn't doesn't last very long. So I spray this around and it just makes this room smell amazing and it just sticks on you it doesn't like doesn't fade when you go out i find so i've been using this and like i said it's by next and it's still there so if you like it go get it and what's also about good about it, it's got a gold tip like gold bowl top and the liquid is pink so what more could you ask for uh next thing i've been loving is this um perfume body spray sorry by ted baker my best friend one of my friends got it for me for my birthday um i absolutely love it because it's ted baker and i've never had anything ted baker less but the case so um I, i've been using this quite a lot i love the smell and the bottle i just think it's amazing and it just looks the bottle i just love the bottle it's so cute and um it this is the same as the body mist it just stays on you throughout the day because some of them don't they just tend to disappear after a while but this don't and it just it's just amazing and I love it and the last thing I've been loving this month is my um te not te Becker, calf kisten bag I had it for my birthday um a couple of months ago and I'm still using it because I'm in love with it and it's my all-time favorite bag of the month 
Um, I just love it. It's so small and so perfect, and it just stops me from carrying way, way too much crap. Uh, the ne the other things I've been loving this month is Jane the Virgin. If you haven't watched it, go check it out. It's amazing. Um, the Walking Dead. I love that at the moment. It's just so, so amazing. I haven't got to season five or anything yet. I'm on season four, but uh, I've been loving that. And I've also been getting back into Hannah Montana. I just love it. I don't care how old I am. I absolutely love it. It just brings back so many good childhood memories when I was a kid and I absolutely love it. I've been singing along to the songs and it just it's just amazing how uh, time cha times change. But uh, it's amazing and I absolutely love it. Um, I've also been watching Once Upon a Time but that is currently stopped for the moment. I'm not sure why I think they're adding on more series or like a new episode or something. So I'm just waiting for that to come back. So yeah, um... My monthly favourites on games um, is uh, Village um, Life, uh, which is on Apple or Android. It, it's a really, really cool game. Go download it. It's called Village Life, and you just make your own village and save like kids and babies from like, rivers and tree stuff. And it's amazing. And I've also been loving My Little Pony, um, which is also really, really cool. Uh, my boyfriend's recently found a game called High Rise, and I've been playing that with him. Um, you basically walk, it's like line play, but you basically walk around, make your own character, make your own house. Um, you can get married in it apparently, and um, you just meet friends, talk to people. I've spoken to people, but they're like asking for my number, so I just got rid of them. But it's a really cool game, and I reckon you should go and play it because it's really, really fun, and I really, really enjoyed it. So I'm sorry, that was that's it of my monthly favourites. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big old thumbs up. Please comment down below other videos you'd like me to do and I'll do them and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I do vlogs as well as hauls and monthly favourites and if you'd like me to do a beauty video I'll do that. So yeah, bye guys.